so guys walk home again um i will just edit this last picture and then i'll call it a day and then so once you just click on the picture you want to edit you just click on it share you can actually import from the lightroom app which i showed you in the previous picture i mean in the previous tutorial so my phone is a bit large with too many pictures i'll just import lightroom so before the days of smartphone if we can remember those times taking pictures was actually a very laborious work and very intensive process and you have to buy a camera or a fancy software you know from your desktop computer you know and also invest your time and some quality energy and even money self to use them but this day things have actually changed the era of our you know mobile device and we can edit apps with them high quality pictures we can take quality pictures with them and also edit with them so all the same sure it could be have a smartphone and I want to welcome each and every one of you all to the class on this tutorial so um and then what I'm trying to say here is that I'll be dropping the the ways to take good pictures with your mobile device I'll drop that in the class while I'll just run this one tutorial and then you can go over to the class and get some other info all right so here's this picture i'm going to work on this picture but what i'm trying to do here i want to change um i want to change the cloud from this pale blue is it blue or ash I want to change it to blue, like deep blue, and also change some other st stuff here. So I'll go to the light, just play around with it, reduce its contrast. See, it's bringing out the color, it's making it deep. You don't know what contrast is. Highlight, removing, it's bringing out the details, you know, shadow, less shadow, okay. White, balanced, black. Okay, you can also work on the light. So we have white. Can do something like this. Let's say we have this. So, here we go. So, since we have, I want to change, we have green here in this picture. We can actually work with green and the blue here. Come to green. Oh boy. forget about that so just tap this and, um, see just tap the button if you made the mistake tap it twice and play off okay so here we go Here we go. So this is before, this is after. Please don't move to uh, to uh, the mix. You can go here. 
the blue you can see the, the sky is changing to what you want you can leave it here or got the saturation we're also having a different sky altogether here we go it's looking as if it's edited um, that's cool so you can just leave it like this <coughs> still go to the green welcome it add some pure saturation to it you know. so at least we are having something better here so not too green, just something green on the field and then for the trees and you can work with this but I don't think we have this color in this picture so here's what we have I'm gonna try the last one Maybe the crown. So I think that's all. You can work on the blue, light blue. Ah, so guys, um, so here's how a screen will look the, the top of the I mean the cloud, sorry, I'm just I'm just um say distracted already. So if you can leave it like this or like this. So you can play around with all this and then you know, get something cool. So it depends on what you want. So, you can save this, you can go to detail when you're done here, click done, click done, come here, um, clarity, you know, it brings out, uh, the picture is not making sense, the okay, and then uh, vignette. Yeah, you can play around with this too, you know. Super cool. So I know you like, uh, you can play around with this. You know, texture is for macro pictures, like um, features that you want details to show very well. Like um, lines, wrinkles on the face, sweat, you know, different things like, like very minute that you want it to show in the picture. So. I think that's all for now and then what else what else what else I told you guys about split and shadow balance so so anyone you want you can play around with blue you want a blue sky yo I want this kind of sky <laughs> yo so so I can Try out this, try out this, try out this. And uh, <coughs> not go do past yourself, sure. Just, just see what you can do and, you know. And have fun. Press down. So this was before and after. And then uh, just increase this sharpening. And then uh, there's too much noise in the picture. Just check around if there's too much noise you can reduce. But for now, I think uh, we're able to go. Press save, save to a gallery, and that's all.